That's it on YouTube. Now, if you're watching this video, you probably own a Blaupunkt uh, stereo or CD player. Uh, it's normally a factory fitted standard unit. Uh, they vary slightly on the faceplate, but they're all pretty much the same if you've got um, a factory car. Now, they put these in quite a lot of different vehicles. So, this is a Chevrolet Kalos, which is the same as a Deu, but you'll find them in Volkswagens and all sorts. Uh, now, you'll probably find that you've got a CD option here, which I'm going to turn right down. Uh, if you press source, you've got aux, source again, you've got radio. So three options. Now I noticed this aux one here, and I took the stereo out and there was no aux plug in the back. So I wondered where's the aux, but I did find a connector in the back, and it turns out you can get this cable here, which I'll open up right now. Now it says Volkswagen on it, but I'm guessing it's all the same. And it's got, that plug there, which will turn it into aux. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to install it. It should be plug and play, really easy, but we'll find out if this cable does in fact work. So, time to remove this. Now looking at the back of this, uh, the standard plug, which is that one there, plugs into, takes up these two sockets. Now there's a really wide socket here and you'll notice that this is the wrong shape. And at first I thought this was the wrong uh, cable, which it still might be, we've got to test it. Um, I'm going to plug it in because it still actually fits in this side here. I'm hoping this side will be the aux, but we'll find out in a minute and see if it fits. Well, it's in there, and it's clipped in there. So I'm gonna just do a quick test and see if it actually does work, but it is in there. Let's remove this part. So, test. There's the radio, CD, aux. I'm gonna plug this into my phone and see if it works. Let's just play any one of these songs. And there we go. I don't know what that beat was. Pause, play. So that is actually working really, really well. So there we go, that's how you install that. And now I'm gonna tidy it up by drilling a hole either back here or up here, but it'll probably be back here somewhere just for this cable to go through so you can um, have access to the aux there. So I'm gonna decide how I'm gonna do that now. There you go, so I've drilled a hole on the top here. The reason why I drilled it on the top and not on the back is so it doesn't fall out as easily because it's actually, I don't know if you can quite see in there, it's quite tricky for it to fall out like that. So you can still pull it through. So there's plenty of cable there. In fact, still a lot more cable there. So let's put this together and see how the final product looks. And there we are, all done. Um, if you do want to see the part number for this, I don't know if you can make it out in the video or not, but it's that one there. Volkswagen on there. Now I picked this up for about two or three pounds from Wish. So it only took about two weeks for it to arrive, but you can pick this up from Amazon, eBay, and pretty much anywhere. But uh, nice and easy, two or three pounds, and it completely transforms the way you listen to music in your car, because you can plug your iPod or your phone, uh, etc., into it. There we are. See you guys in the next one.